Hello everyone, Zero Fossil Fuel. Today is Wednesday, August 17, 2011, and this is a Zero News update. Um, I would appear on camera right now, but uh, I had a small procedure done to my face, and right now I've got a, uh, a pillow over my nose <laughs> and uh, Harry Potter glasses in front of my eyes to fit over the pillow that's on my nose. Uh, if you'd like to find out what that is really all about, you can join us live on Justin TV, uh, where I do broadcast live uh, and uh, am unable to hide my present appearance. Anyway, um, while broadcasting on, uh, live on Justin TV last night, Tuesday the 16th, I had recorded a set of data with the Mueller motor running at 9 volt input to the drive coils. My no load current at that time was 460 milliamps and my speed was 2,892 RPM. There was a little bit of a rattle in my bearings that I wanted to quiet down so I decided to close down the spacing a tiny bit between the motor end plates to preload the, the bearings a little bit. Um, the threads that keep them spaced are 1 quarter by 20 threads and I turned the nuts that uh, lock it in place inward approximately one-third of a turn or sixteen thousandths of an inch. With that adjustment uh, it took out the the play that was in the bearings and there was no detectable increase in the friction of the rotor. However, by moving the stator poles closer uh, just eight thousandths of an inch my no load current rose from 460 milliamps to 650 milliamps and the RPMs dropped to about 22 I'm sorry 2550 RPM my measured efficiency power out over power in where I was getting 43 percent instantly dropped to 29 percent efficiency I lost 30 to 35 percent of my total system efficiency just by moving the gap closer eight thousandths of an inch uh, between the stator poles and the rotor magnets. Had I not seen it for myself I would have never believed that such a small change in the stator pole spacing would have that profound an impact on the performance. By moving the nuts back one half of a turn twenty-five thousandths of an inch or four thousandths of an inch greater on each side than where I started and precisely balancing the signal phasing of the two drive coils my night ended last night Tuesday August 16 2011 with a total system efficiency of fifty two point three percent that's power out over power in now I know for a fact that my stator pole gap around the rotor varies as much as twelve thousandths of an inch plus or minus. The need to be able to independently adjust each stator pole to very tight tolerance is becoming very evident. Uh, one more thing is now also very clear. I am knocking at the door and that door will be opened. Um, a lot of the experimenters who have tried making replications of this motor I have heard report uh, total power conversion efficiencies in the single digits of percentages, low single digits. And uh, for me to be turning out 52.3% it's phenomenal. Um, absolutely phenomenal. I need to thank Hydrotech one more time for producing such an awesome sketch for the Arduino. I would like you to know that version 1.3 is being uploaded as I upload this YouTube video. Um, Hydrotech fixed the bug that was in the sketch that uh, was related to the analog adjustments. So that was a, a bug fix. And he also added for us PS2 keyboard direct entry of the Mueller mo of the Arduino sketch parameters. So don't even need to attach it to a computer anymore if you've got a PS2 keyboard. You can attach it to the Arduino board and just enter the parameters directly from a keyboard. Unbelievable. I, I don't know when the guy will stop, but he's having fun. I'm having fun. We're all having fun. Um, I hope you follow along. The uh, I, I do broadcast many evenings live from Justin TV. That's 
justin.tv forward slash zero fossil fuel and uh, I almost always send out a tweet prior to my broadcast I almost always have 25 to 35 people in the chat room and in, in the audience by the end of the evening and uh, if you want to have some fun I hope you can join me there that's all for now zero fossil fuel hopefully the next time I do a video I'll actually be able to appear on camera everyone take care peace